So how does Spirit DAO works, for example? They assign you to an audit and how, how does the process work? Do you know? Uh, so, so yeah, uh, yeah they, they have a pretty nice structure. I think they are still um, putting the final touches on the details of their structure and everything. But uh, uh, first of all, you have, you have this uh, crazy technical test, which is automated, which is great because uh, it's like 50 minutes or something. And after it ends, you just submit your uh, your tasks uh, and your test, and you you already know if you passed or not, which is automated. This is great, but the test is very hard. You you need like uh, at the beginning of the test, you see you need like 60% uh, correct answers, which sounds low, but the the questions are very hard. Yeah. It... Uh, Sorry. The answers are insane. You say. Yeah, the, the questions are very hard. I got like 65% or something. I guess I got a bit of luck there. But but yeah, I passed, which was great. And uh, then you have a, some cultural like meet interview and you, you get accepted into the into the DAO. And uh, yeah, there, there you have levels. You have like a junior security researcher. You have a medium level. You have the senior level or the lead level. And... Um, I mean, there are some some crazy good people in in the space that are working there. I know C. Michel is there. I know um, Alex is there. I mean, some 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 famous people in the space. But but yeah, uh, basically, when they have a client, when they have business, uh, when a client comes to them, uh, they speak about the budget and they, for, for example, if the client says we have a hundred thousand dollars budget. Spearbit will find some of the people based based on their ranks. Based on your ranking there and on your position, you get a different payment. For example, the junior security researcher gets paid three thousand dollars a week, and they they gather this team uh, to fulfill the budget, and um, and you you get you get on an audit. And uh, actually, you can see their audits on GitHub. They have a nice nice portfolio of their past work and they have uh, found some some very interesting findings they have some great um, issues found so they're doing very well i think they have a good uh, reputation in the space it sounds super interesting and are you excited oh you you cannot believe it i mean i i cannot wait for my first first audit actually just yesterday i got accepted i mean i'm still not even onboarding uh, I will be onboarding maybe next month or whatever. I can't, I cannot wait. But uh, the best thing is I will network with a lot of people. I will meet a lot of cool people there. Uh, I have already made some friends from Coderina which are working there, and even through some Web3 events that I went on uh, this year. And uh, yeah, it's great. It's great. I cannot wait to to be part of an audit there. Wow, that's insane. I mean, wow. I'm super happy for you and excited. And you're definitely gonna learn. And I, I, I see you like in like maybe one or two years, like replacing, not replacing C. Michel, but I just see your dedication and the way you can sit like 15 hours in a day and just learn and, and you grind on contests. On, on, I mean, there is no other option. You know, you, you, get, you will get to the top. So maybe you're a beginner or medium level, doesn't matter now how you're classified in Spirit Out, but I have no like, no question that you will get advanced to the to the more senior auditor, and then there is like there is like auditor and there is like master auditor that makes like twenty k per week or something, something like crazy, yeah, that, right? That's the lead. The lead auditor, right? Twenty k per per week, which is insane. And I won't be surprised if like in six months I will see you like uh, <laughs> maybe one year, but <laughs> the lead uh, auditor. Yeah, yeah. I, I think I will need a little bit more time, but but yeah, that's my goal. I, I hope someday I, be, I come to this level. And of course, this way I will make a lot of money and I will contribute a lot to the space and I will help other people get to this level as well, which is, which is great. It's a win-win situation. That's the best thing about this space. It's not like some scammer stuff or whatever. It's not like shit coins or uh, FTX style of things, like uh, give me your liquidity or whatever. It's, a, it's really value creations so it's very nice and that's the other fun thing that's why i accepted this interview because it will be fun to see myself into in, into after two years uh, when i watch this interview it will probably be very fun because as i said i'm still i'm still on my first six months into this uh, and yeah but i'm putting a lot of time in